I bought myself this Kube knife on Amazon. Obviously it's kind of like this orange nylon type of material on the side. It's slightly textured. You might be able to see that there. It's got a little bit of like a canvas like feel almost to it. And then obviously some pretty big like ribbing kind of almost like ocean waves down the side. So it feels nice in the hand and it feels kind of durable and weather resistant. I'm assuming it's like polymer or nylon, something like that. A lot of fuzz on it from the box. And then bolted down with some pretty serious, looks like stainless steel hardware all along the the body of it. And then it looks like stainless steel hardware. You can see the spacers in there. Then you have an assisted, uh, an opening assist right here that has some notches. So you should get a nice grip on that. You can see the back side of the blade here, which is kind of cool. It's really rounded. And then even the hole for the thumb assist, you know, the edge is beveled right there, which makes it much more comfortable. Honestly, I feel like you could cut your finger on some of the, the holes that are just drilled through and not finished. And you have a seriously thick clip here, like the, uh, the notch there. So it should fit on your belt. It's skeletonized a little bit. Looks nice. Some serrations right here. I'm assuming maybe to be able to get grip on, especially right here, up here. So your thumb is probably going to be putting pressure on the knife. So let's go ahead and open it up. Obviously you can open it up just like that. Man, that is smooth. Jeez, that's smooth. Really fast with your index finger or kind of give it a little toss just like that. Boom! And I did. And then this kind of will... I like how it's curved right in here where your finger would be too. So this is nice and comfortable. Nice little Nice thought there so that you don't have any sharp edges there as well. A little bit of like a Tanto style blade, a little bit of a hockey stick action right there. Man, polished right there, kind of the brush finish. Um, very sharp blade, no doubt. I guess I can definitely tell the difference between a knife that's, you know, in the $30 range versus a knife that's in the $10 range. You know, even just the metal up here, I don't know why the weight is, it must be thicker up in here. So, great knife. Man, this would be my go-to pocket knife at the moment.